Hey everybody, this is Connie from Chaos to Peace Consulting and uh, it has been a while. I was away for four weeks. I was in Switzerland first for three weeks working, serving my clients, meeting with friends and family and then I was a week in Austria, a little bit on vacation. It's uh, at the same time um, updating my knowledge about the moon wisdom, which some of you know that I'm interested in and living by, uh, which was very relaxing, um, very insightful. And now I'm back and earlier this week I committed to make a video, a live video. <laughs> and uh, me being a little camera shy sometimes, um, having a hard time with it, but here I am. <laughs> and um, so I promised to keep it short. Um, so I wanted to come live with the tip for today, a tips first day. And um, it the idea came while I was in Switzerland and I met with one of my uh, clients slash friends and she was uh, complaining, well not complaining, but she was kind of talking to me about her digital clutter and how she's overwhelmed and what a big chaos it is and that she has to go through it all and clean it up and organize it and that she never finds time and um, she asked me for um, advice and I said well, rather than trying to organize and um, declutter your huge uh, digital jumble bumble, why not think first how you could organize it in the future or how you would want to have it organized in the future, like what categories you would want to have, um, what like you want to have it organized by client, organized by year, organized by month. Think of that first and then Every time you're working on a, on one of these projects, you have to go into your old jumble <laughs> of digital files. But you can, once you find that file, you can then move it over into your new structure, into your new organization, and then it's there. And so, if you do this for a little while <clears throat> and work with your new structure, and also uh, figure out whether this new structure works for you. At the same time, you're moving your most important um, uh, files over and um, it doesn't really cost extra time because you have to look for the file anyways and then you just save it in the new space. And um, so that, that way you actually don't have to find time to go through the, through the files and declutter. You're doing it in the process that you're doing anyways while you're working on these files. And then after a while, it might be a few weeks, it might be a few months, um, you have extracted all the important files and then you, you can make a, a more informed decision. Do you really need and want to go through the old files and, and declutter that and restructure that? Or did you just want to keep this saved, backed up somewhere um, for keepsake and you, you just, use um, your new structure from now on. So um, she thought that was a, a very cool um, tip. And so I thought maybe you find this a very cool tip too. So again, instead of going through your old structure, going through it and deciding what to delete and what not to delete, just setting up your new structure and start working with your new structure. And um, saving all the files you're anyways working on right away into the new structure and then after a while you never even have to address the old structure or the old uh, mess of digital files anymore and then you could either maybe delete it. <laughs> Hi Terry! Um, you could either delete them then or you could just save them and um, put them somewhere safe and like you may or may not ever need them again. And after a few months or years, you may decide, oh, I realize I never had to go back to this old structure. I obviously don't need these files. Then it's probably safe to delete them. So this is my tip Thursday. And um, uh, I hope you find value. Let me know in the comments below if that helped or not. Um, if you have any questions or if you would want to hear any other tips on how to stay organized in the office, um, let me know in the comments below. And um, I'm, I'm working on creating um, 
kind of a safe environment um, that I would like to call the organized entrepreneur. And um, we're going to talk about little hacks and tricks how to stay organized during the week um, without any extra effort or extra time. So if you're interested in that, let me know in the comments below. And um, I'm working on it. And I can keep you updated uh, on this page. So, OK. Thanks for joining in and have a great day. Bye, guys.